Hey, good morning, students, and uh, happy Friday. Uh, what, a, what a semester this has been. I could tell you that um, uh, I did not expect when I, when I uh, put this course on the calendar that we would have as many things going on uh, in the market as we had. Uh, I don't think anybody could have predicted that uh, Donald Trump would have won and that as, a, uh, that as a result that the market would go up 10% or so. Um, nobody would have seen that uh, uh, the election in, Par in, in France would have had such a, a huge impact. Um, and then today we've got obviously a pretty significant terror attack in, uh, in London. And, uh, and I'm checking and it, and it doesn't look like it's having too much of an impact, but it is, well, starting to have a little bit of an impact now, isn't it? So there, the, um, uh, it wasn't, uh, it was a cyber attack, fairly significant one on, uh, on their, on their hospital systems. So let's see what time is it there. Now their markets are closed. So, uh, we won't uh, necessarily see the impact of this until Monday, which is good because maybe they'll be able to get it squared away by then. But who would have seen these things coming? So what, a, what an interesting time to take a class. Um, so we're, we've got to make a, a shift here on uh, points. Originally, there was 1,100 points because um, I had set up in Blackboard for, for uh, uh, a couple of other quizzes, uh, and an, uh, at least one other quiz and an exam to come online, and they didn't. And uh, they're sitting there, and I'm, I was trying to figure out why they didn't open. Um, so as a result, I've got to shift the points. So no longer 1,100 points available. Now there's only 900 points available, which is good. Uh, but we had eight assignments, 15 discussion comments, quizzes, et cetera, right? It's a total 900 points, which means that if you were shooting for an A, I need 800 points or more. Uh, if you want a B, 720 points or more, 630, et cetera. If you have less than 539 points uh, by the end of next week, um, uh, or not next week, but the week after that, then uh, you're you're looking at a at a fail. The good news is the class is going to be offered on campus next semester, which is great because um, I've heard from a bunch of you uh, that this would be a much better class on campus. So at least you get another whack at it. As of today. Uh, I've given 680 of those 900 points. What's remaining is the exam and then uh, an assignment, a discussion comment, and a quiz. Oh, not a quiz, and the exam, so there's, and a project. So there's like one of each of these things, except for the quiz, that are, uh, that are still slated. So there's still a fair number of points, right? So, uh, you know, there's uh, 720 points, or roughly, call it a quarter of all the points, are still available. And so you still got a, a shot at this, right? So if we were to close the grades today, uh, you know, 680 points, if you had 612 points or better, you're tracking an A. And, um, uh, and the reality is, is that, you know, you need what, 810. So you just need to do well on the, uh, on the final exam and you're, you're in good shape. So, um, but the, the reality is, is that you've, you've got uh, a little bit of work to do yet if, uh, if you are, uh, you know, at, at or below 400 points. Wait, what happened here? This is a math error. Let me take a look at this. Let me pull up the table. So this should have been equals this times 0.6. And then this should just be 407. So that number is right. So let me go back to this. So if you've got less than 407 points, you are... Uh, you're looking at, at, a, at an F. So, but you know, honestly, you still got a shot at, uh, you know, you do well on the final exam uh, and you still got a shot at even getting into a C or, or, uh, or maybe even a shot at a B. So this is what I wanna do. I'm gonna be putting this up here so you guys can download or review it at your own, at your own uh, pleasure. Uh, here's what you can do is, uh, I do this every semester. Um, I'm gonna give you a shot at making up your points. So uh, I want you to complete all the assignments by Sunday, May 14th. Yeah, I know it's Mother's Day. And you know what? Your mom would be stoked if you got an A in this class. It's a heck of a lot. Get her a card, uh, uh, send her some flowers, and tell her you're working on an A in your class, and she'll be very happy. Or take her to brunch and then come home and hunker down and do your stuff. Or heaven forbid, 
do the work today, right? But if you can get all the work completed, because Monday I'm gonna go into the office and the first thing I'm gonna do is grade uh, all of the work uh, up to this point. Now the work's gotta be top notch. You can't just give me a couple sentences. I'm gonna be looking for the performance as if uh, it, was, uh, it was required before. But you get up to 75 points. If you, give me, if, you, if you turn in work that's subpar, then you get less than 75 points. Let's say, for example, you're, you're working this weekend, you're working a total of 48 hours over the weekend. I always love hearing that. I'm working all weekend. Um, uh, and let's say you're not able to do it, but you're able to complete it by Friday. I will give you up to 50% of the points. So those of you that did well and you did all the work that you were supposed to do, you get all the points. Those of you that, uh, for whatever reason, fell behind, you've still got a shot uh, at, uh, at, at not just passing, but maybe doing well. So um, that's what I got for today. If you guys have any questions, I mean, there's a bunch of you that email me, text me, call me. Keep doing that because I, I tend to respond very quickly, um, especially if it's, uh, if it's an easy answer. Have a good weekend. Uh, but if you're behind, don't have a good weekend. Don't go out tonight. You can go out next Friday. Get caught up on your homework. Thanks, everybody.